So it looks like Luffy is being thrown into the same cell as Kid, okay? Eustace Kid, a confirmed Conqueror's user. This chapter was insane, okay? I actually enjoyed this chapter. We got a bunch of information revealed to us. Uh, Eustace is a Conqueror's Hockey user, um, which I kind of suspected in the beginning because he was placed above Luffy. I think him and Luffy are the only Conqueror's Hockey users out of the Supernovas. That's just my opinion. There might be another one, but I'm not sure. Um, let's talk about the cover page. The cover page was sent to Maru pretty much just hammering uh some wood for some old beer cup so luffy is right with kid right now he's in the same exact cell as kid and kid is such a badass this guy was given a fish with bones and he used the bones to kill a guardsman okay that's why they don't even give him fish with bones i'm the one side make sure to subscribe leave a like comment and let's get right into this video there's going to be no intro for today just because this chapter was insane okay I, I just loved it i loved it i love this one more i kind of like this one as much as last week's chapter and last week's chapter was a five out of five for me this one is like a four out of five just because of all the information we got and just pretty much like i don't know i just love seeing other supernovas uh first of all we found out that sea stone actually like sea stone craftsmen actually originate from wano because I, that makes sense okay that makes a lot of sense to me just because even the pony glyphs are made in wano so sea stone craftsmen are also made in wano we found out that everyone is in like in uh, Wano is also finding about Luffy's scuffle with Kaido and people are just making fun of him and Kaido even said that he was kind of glaring at him when Luffy was dead. Uh, we saw Luffy using Conqueror's Hockey and he took down all the people around him and then Kaido's like, oh you have the same ability as Eustace and he told him to turn him into a soldier. I wonder what that means, like how is he going to turn him into a soldier? Are they just going to break his spirit until he just fights for Kaido unwillingly? Um, but we know that's not going to happen to Luffy of course. Um, but yeah, so even Kaido stated that we don't need this many conquerors, which is insane, okay? So that means they have Kid, Luffy, and I also think Kaido is probably a conqueror just because he said we don't need this many, which is, which is, uh, which makes sense if Kaido's a conqueror. You know, he's the Yonko of his crew. Um, I think everyone agrees that Kaido is a conqueror's hockey user. Um... It looks like Kid is still willing to fight because at the end of the chapter he said, Kaido, you will pay for this. So it still looks like there's a spirit in him. Uh, but Basil Hawkins, I don't know because he's kind of weird. He's very, he seems very loyal to Kaido. So we don't, I don't know if we're going to get him on our side. I think we will. Um, but right now he seems very loyal. Just because he doesn't, I think he thinks there's no outcome other way than losing to Kaido. So yeah. So I think Luffy and Kid probably will team up. I don't know how they're going to break out though. That's the problem. Maybe with Kid, maybe with uh, X-Drake. X-Drake is a big one. But somehow they're going to break out. Maybe if the others come after them. Uh, but now everyone knows that Luffy's probably been captured. Everyone's Stry Hats probably know just because that newspaper was out. So it makes sense if they all know. Nami and the others survived the the, the blast from Kaido. Apparently the, the Shinobu girl, the the ninja she has the mature mature fruit where she's able to touch the ground well she didn't say it's the fruit she said it's the ability where she's able to touch anything and mature she touched the ground and soft and made the sand rot so they were able to skip i i, I really thought it was going to be that big ass door that we saw in the a couple chapters ago that's what i thought um kaido is still looking menacing i don't know how kaido knew that luffy was glaring at him so that's like something he's like you know we don't know well, I guess Shuin Maru was confirmed to be Ashura Doji, okay? Because I think someone yelled at him, Ashura Doji, uh, yelling his name. So, yeah, we already knew that Shuin was Ashura, Ashura Doji. That's not a big point to this. I already knew about that. Like, we already kind of predicted that. Um, Nekamamushi is... Not Nekamamushi, my bad. Inurashi is there, uh, just chilling. And he even said, well, how could you do this to a kid? Talking about really Kaido doing it to... I think he was talking about Luffy, but I'm not sure. It didn't seem like he was talking about Luffy when he said that. Let me know. Other than that, I'm the one strat. Make sure to subscribe, leave a like, comment. I'm always making One Piece reviews, making One Piece content, and uh, My Hero, other anime. So subscribe to this channel if you want. Other than that, I'm gone. Peace out, guys.